Just a short drive south of Grand Haven, Michigan lies the golf course. Amazing and beautiful like many others, but extraordinary like no other. The course is based on three principles. Welcome to American Dunes Golf Course. This is the story of 16 Patriots, veterans, fighter pilots who have never shied away from an act of valor, who have gathered here to celebrate their brotherhood, their camaraderie, their friendship, and their freedom, and the love of the game of golf. But also to remember, reflect, and honor the brothers that have gone before them. This all takes place here at American Dunes, where golf's most heroic round is played. The course founded by the great Jack Nicklaus and Lieutenant Colonel Dan Rooney, PGA professional and F-16 fighter pilot. So before we tee off, let's look at some of what makes this course so special. As you enter, the story of the golf course unfolds itself. And as you continue the walk, the story of some of the fallen warriors that have gone before us unfold as well. This is just one of the many places around the course where you can honor the warriors that have sacrificed their all to preserve the freedoms that we have today, such as this amazing round of golf. The course is set among a towering forest of Michigan red pines and is an 18 hole par 72 dunes course. The layout of the course is great for both high and low handicappers. But what is a golf course without a great clubhouse? And this one is among the most special of them all. To start, let's check out CAVU, which is an aeronautical term for ceiling and visibility unlimited. It's pretty much a fighter squadron bar at the golf course that you can't stop raving about. Lieutenant Colonel Dan Rooney, who you see on the wall here, is the founder of American Dunes and also Folds of Honor, which we'll hear about later. His call sign is Noonan. Noonan did such a great job with this place. There's so much fighter squadron memorabilia around the bar, such as this detailed model of Pardo's push. There are also relics and items that you might find in any fighter squadron bar. There's an ejection seat from an F-16, an F-16 gun barrel. So this gun barrel right here is from one of our buddies, Bob's Buchanan, who's here with us on this trip. And he had this sent to American Dunes. And several pictures of fighter pilots that tell a story, and also of amazing fighter jets like the almighty F-16 Viper that you can't all but stop and look at. And let's not forget the coolest bar tap that I've ever seen. This is an AIM-9 Sidewinder heat sinking missile that travels over Mach 2. Several of us here on this trip have shot one of these off the F-16. Before you depart, a swing by the golf shop is a must. They have some of the greatest swag of any golf course here. The American Dunes logo is a great combination between Jack Nicklaus, Folds of Honor, and the F-16 fighter jet. The clubhouse is as welcoming as any fighter squadron bar, and the staff is most hospitable here. You never know who you might run into and what legendary tales or embellished truths you might hear. Now let's not be late for our tea time. It's time to have some fun on this course. Before you tee off, there are a few formalities and traditions which make this course special that are explained on the first tee by the, the starter. The nickel on the grass, you guys are familiar with this. Let me give each of you guys a nickel. And when you come up 18, you know the story, but that's where we have our tribute, all right? Um, and then the other thing that we do every day at 1300, we play taps followed by 13 bells. We just ask everyone on the course to pause for a couple minutes. We'll explain the details of that a little later. So let me introduce you to this cast of 16. We're gonna tee off, have some fun, and see what this course is all about. All right, have a good round, boys. All right, welcome to American Dunes. On. Hey, this is coconut. <laughs> Hey, 
Caleb. One of my first F-16 instructors, by the way. That's right. Yeah. Between him and Mega, I'm trying to determine who I should have watched out. Ah! And the man, Mega. What's up, balls? The hardiest wing now. Holly Pichet. That was fun. There's no strategy in golf, you just grip it and rip it. As expected, American Dunes exceeded its reputation. They were great rounds of golf with great company. Fairways were sprayed and a lot of sand was played. Birdies were made and we almost had the coveted hole in one. Sorry Brick, you came up just a couple inches short again. Laughter rolled. Oh, baby, there it is. I love it. Smoker would do it. Libations American flowed. Dance. It's epic. Them, them. Cheers. Them, them. We were fueled by great camaraderie on a great course. Laughter. And of course, fighter pilots are always competing, so there's always a skins game when we play golf. <laughs> you can see we're having a good time. Such an amazing group of uh, veterans, patriots great guys that I golf with every week and it's such an honor to be here at American Dunes and for the par. Ready? Here you go. Are you going to say there you go. Oh! Boom. That was an epic round at American Dunes day 1, Grand Haven, Michigan. But as the last putt fell and the sun slowly set over American Dunes, more laughter more libations, and more lies could be heard told around the glowing fire pits on the patio overlooking this great Unbelievable, course. I love you guys. Hey! hey. 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 Dude, I got you do? Hey. Why didn't you toast that like an hour and a half ago? Damn, we're like, oh. She did. She did say it. It was a great evening had by all, even despite seeing a surprising deceased insect on the patio. But this story can't be complete without honoring and remembering our veterans who were killed or disabled in combat, and how American Dunes partners with Folds of Honor to give back to the families of those that have sacrificed their all. You see, on each one of the 18 tee boxes at American Dunes, there's a story of a fallen warrior who gave their all and sacrifice for our freedom. Like our brother Trojan, who you see here on hole number 15. Those nickels on his memorial are a fighter pilot tradition to show remembrance and respect. The fighter pilot tradition of a nickel on the grass comes from an old song and poem. So here's a nickel on the grass to you, my friend, and your spirit, enthusiasm, sacrifice, and courage. But most of all, to your friendship. Yours is a dying breed, and when you are gone, the world will be a lesser place. 
So remember that nickel we received on tee box number one. As you approach the tee box on 18, after coming off the green on 17, there is a memorial here at American Dunes with a plaque that says nickel on the grass. So throw your nickel on the grass and save a fighter pilot's ass and take the time to honor and respect those that are no longer here with us. All right, nickel on the grass to all the bros that have gone before us. Nickel on the grass. Nickel on the grass. In addition to these memorials, every day at American Dunes, there are reverent times. At 1300, taps is played, and at 1730, the national anthem is played. So please remember to pause your round, face the American flag, and show your respect. As you enter American Dunes, Folds of Honor's mantra is laid out on the wall. Honor their sacrifice, educate their legacy. And Folds of Honor provides scholarships to the families of those warriors killed or disabled in combat to do just this. So to tie it all together, the founder of American Dunes, Lieutenant Colonel Dan Rooney, is also the founder of Folds of Honor. And the proceeds from your round at American Dunes goes back to Folds of Honor and to the scholarships that they provide to the families of those warriors. If you want more information, go to foldsofhonor.org and join the mission to spread the word or donate. And if you're at an air show, look to the skies because our very own hamster who's on this trip is the official Folds of Honor biplane air show pilot, helping spread the word across this great nation about this great organization. And this is why a round at American Dunes is the most heroic round you'll ever play. Because the round is not just for you, but it's for those that are honored through Folds of Honor. So I hope you enjoyed this Tale of 16. It was an amazing weekend with an amazing group of individuals at an amazing golf course. It was more than just another guy's golf trip. It was a celebration of freedom, camaraderie, and a joy of the game. It was an honor for me to be a part of this group and this experience. So I hope you enjoy these memories. Keep them to yourself or share them with your friends and family. But most importantly, spread the word about American Dunes and Folds of Honor. Godspeed and God bless. Be sure to follow us on TikTok and Instagram and check out our website at americantravelfamily.com. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more American Travel Family adventures. Hey, this isn't putt putt. I'm going to keep practicing that one for a bit. <laughs>